Hey there and welcome. So we are going to continue on uh, to Priority Horizon. But first, we got to check around the set at all because you got to get stuff done when you're here. So, got to to Tally. Of course. We can have ships at the colony in 36 hours. Do you need medical support? No. Evacuating the colony is more than enough. Thank you, Ambassador. Ambassador? I'm coordinating actions for the fleet while we're here. Evacuating colonies, bolstering Turian defense lines. Huh. I think it was right here. Three years ago to the day. What? This was where Saren's assassins fired at me. I'd just gotten to the Citadel. I didn't think I needed my barriers up. My mistake. We'll just do it, in case you don't remember. Saren had assassins after you? Right. I disabled the Geth and found that recording that proved he was working with the Reapers. I went to Ilium and tried to inform the authorities, but Saren's mercenaries attacked me. I barely escaped. I stowed away on a Turian freighter and came out here. I thought I was safe. I can understand Saren's thugs sneaking around in the wards, but the Presidium... Silenced muzzle, polonium rounds... Nobody even heard it. It was just a jab in the arm. And then radiation and rupture warnings. It was the first time I'd been really hurt on my pilgrimage. I ran to the Council Embassy, asked for protection, offered the data on Seren. The Turian clerk called me Soot Rat. He threatened to have me tossed off the station if I didn't leave. I wish that clerk could see you now. He just did. That was him back there. I don't think he remembers me. Maybe we should go have a little talk with that clerk. Yeah, she would. <laughs> I she spent would. three years waiting to come back and make his life hell. But when I finally saw him, he was just a clerk whose people desperately need help. Which they'll get, thanks to you. Nice work, Ambassador. This war is more important than grudges and prejudice. Maybe he and I both needed to grow up a little. The difference is that you helped when it counted. Thanks, Shepard. So did you. Really? Everything looks so peaceful. In here, you can almost forget about the war. I never get tired of looking at this place. I never thought they'd let a quarry in up here. The Presidium is so beautiful. Everything looks so peaceful. I don't remember if Garrus is hanging out below. Uh, I think we'll go check there though, just in case. Um, I don't want to miss any conversations. Spectre status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. And I think then we're done because I don't think anybody else is anywhere. Now arriving at docking bay I know it's on a map, but uh, he's already he's not here anymore. James, we could maybe he might have some like click lines, but Zaid maybe. No. Do you know the current leader of the Suns? Same dialogue. Same dialogue. Welcome to Venterian State Arms. We couldn't boot Stand from strong the for your people fast enough. with Batarian State Arms. He never stops cracking me up that he just talks and talks and talks and talks and talks and talks. I love it. You wouldn't think. Alright, no, nope. I'm gonna go look for Garrus and then maybe James and I'm not expecting anything. I don't know I thought Garrus left, but Yeah, I don't know where the hell they go. But we'll check on Jamesy. Oh, where's James? Hold on. I'm confused. That implies seven is James is with the Zaid. Hold on. Did I walk right past him and not know? Interesting. He was here. 
Oh my god, you can attack. James? Okay. Commander, what brings you down here? I was about to ask you that. Well, after our little chat. Ow! I made up my mind. I'm gonna join the N7 program. And you're celebrating by getting a tattoo? <laughs> sort of. See, there's no official channels to go through right now. So, I guess this is my way of making it official. Technically, I'm just an N7 recruit, but, you know, I figure with you as my training officer, how could I fail, right? I'm flattered, but I wouldn't exactly say I'm training you. Not officially, but what the hell is in this goddamn war? I'm just saying, whether you like it or not, you're my direct superior and you're N7. So I take my lead from you, and you know, I'll take whatever advice you got. Really? Sure. The good advice. Don't take this lightly, Vega. I'm not. And I won't. I know it seems like I don't take things seriously, but when I commit to something, I fully commit. Clearly. Hey, I won't let you down. Don't just tell me. Show me. Yes, ma'am. You know, that's gonna sting for a few days. You gonna be ready for duty? Always. Hey, maybe we should get matching. You want me to get an N7 tattoo? N7? Sure. Or you could get my name done. Somewhere special. You're such a tease, oh Vega. God. Who, Ew. me? You ever gonna no, make like good Vega, on all this flirting? Ugh. Uh, I was just... I didn't mean to... Yeah. You know, I was oh. just... Shut up. <laughs> That's what I thought. Later, Lieutenant. Yeah, Later. I hate that. I hate ah! that. Okay. Careful. Enjoy your tattoo, darling. Now it acts like he's moved. If I go back there, will he be there? I mean, I doubt it. I'm not going to bother. Uh, hold on. In minutes. Oh. I'm glad I looked because Miranda is waiting for us. I knew she was. Hold on. That is the Presidium. Status recognized. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. I'm guessing one of these. Uh, no. No, the Krogan are the only race that can fight on the toxic world, so they need Probably that same room that I was used. Hmm, so we're next to it. I got your message, Miranda. Is this about your sister? Shepard, I need access to Alliance resources. I can't say any more. You'll just have to trust me. I don't like secrets, Miranda. Just tell me what's going on. I can't, Shepard. If that's a problem, I'll go. Don't. Trust is a little hard to come by right now. Of course. If you can't tell me anything, I'm not taking resources away from the fight. Fair enough. I was wrong to ask for help. Not wrong, but I can't do it. Is there anything else? Yes. I need to tell you something. Confess, really. It's been eating away at me. Confess? <sighs> when I headed the Lazarus Project to rebuild you, I wanted to implant a control chip in you as a safeguard. I think you mentioned this. I did. There's more to it. The elusive man stopped me. Sounds like it would have saved him a lot of trouble. Maybe. He didn't want to interfere with who you truly were. Something that just obeyed orders. He wanted Commander Shepard. Installing the chip might have ruined you. I'm glad you didn't. Better to stay dead than be someone's plaything. Exactly. Why bring that up now? I fought against my father and his need to run every aspect of my life. He wanted total control over me, right down to my bloody DNA. After I got out of there, I couldn't stand by and let it happen to my sister. I risked my life to get her away from all that. Yet I didn't give a second thought to destroying your free will when I had the power. 
This is what's been bothering you? Yes. Miranda, I lost two years of my life. You gave me back the rest of it. You could have taken everything from me, made me a prisoner. But you didn't. I don't know how, but you brought me back. Thanks. But with so much being uncertain, I just wanted you to know I always regretted wanting that chip. Apology accepted. We can't change the past, and we have enough to deal with right now. Yes, we do. Some things you just don't have control over. Guess my fancy genetics can't help me there. No, they can't. Okay. I hate to say it, but I should get moving. Thanks for understanding, Shepard. Of course. And Miranda, this thing you have to do. Good luck. Don't worry, Shepard. I always have a plan. I don't know if we can talk to Cortez at the bar, but we should try that. We'll go to Purgatory. We already talked to Jacob. Let's go to Purgatory. We haven't talked to Bailey, but I just don't know if there's anything to say. So we'll check Purgatory. And then check the embassies for Bailey. Because I think we were supposed to sit down and talk to Cortez, but he might just be like hanging out and want to be alone. Maybe dancing? Um, Joker is still dancing. And I've checked. <laughs> said he was here. Oh. Maybe he's drinking. Okay, sure. The alliance wasn't good for business before, but this is war. See, he's actually on the dance floor, so that's incorrect as well. My planet's on fire, I can't see him. Tell your friend. I'm not needed to yeah, answer talk to me. I would love some time alone. Don't blame her, but uh, yeah, I don't see him, so it's a lie unless he's hiding. I'll do one check because I came here and I feel like. Oh! Shepard, you made it! Come yep. have a drink with me. There we go. I didn't see him. He's supposed to pop up. You're looking little... happy. Circle. You had it right. Yesterday can't change. Tomorrow, we might all be dead. Today is what matters. I'm not wasting it. I wouldn't have thought a club would be to your tastes. You don't have to get all hot and bothered to appreciate graceful dancing. There's an energy here. There's light. Graceful dancing. And purgatory serves the best Darling. drinks. Darling. Here. Okay. Here's to fresh beginnings. And a better tomorrow. Thank you. For everything. Sorry, darling. I wish I could be friendly with you, but... I have commitments to be bad. Or to be not that approachable, lovable, I don't know. Spectre status, recognize. One moment, please. Alright, so check Bailey and then get the hell out of here. Because I want to do some combat, apparently. Uh, so many pieces to put back together since the Cerberus attack. 
We're reeling from the implications. Udina in league with Cerberus trying to murder the Council. These are dark days for all of us. You got your work cut out for you. Okay. You and me both, Shepard. I, I, we probably asked about his injuries, right? He seems okay. Like, he's okay. Let's just get out of here. Let's just get out of No one's here, so. At docking bay D24. We're gonna do a priority. Do do. Commander. And this was the place that people were going and... Okay, who should we take? I feel Ash would be a good place. I mean, taking Evie feels like a no fuck you, though. And I appreciate that. I don't like the back outfit, so... Liara... I guess I'll leave you behind on this one. It's not by choice. Although I do like taking my biotic. So what do we know, Commander? Edie? The Sanctuary facility was devoted to aiding refugees from Reaper-controlled systems. The facility went offline recently, and no communications have come or gone since. It is unclear why Kai Lang or Cerberus would be interested in Sanctuary. We don't leave until we're one step closer to Cerberus. Ma'am, I'm picking up a signal from the facility. It's weak, but I'll try to boost it. Oriana? That's Miranda's sister. If she's here, Miranda can't be far away. That's our link to Cerberus. Approaching the LZ. Seeing some I guess damage it's good we waited no then to do this until we talked to Miranda, right? So, yay. I'm, I'm real good. I meant to do it. I meant to do it. It was good. Cerberus does not get the jump on us this time. Stay sharp, people. This place is pretty busted up. Some kind of firefight. Yeah, but who was fighting? Yes, radio's offline. Something's jamming our signals. Explain to the code. We got trouble!
phantoms. Hate these guys. They were evacuating. And looks like the Reapers were gunning for him. About time they started killing each other. That's where we're headed. All arrivals are asked to submit their possessions to our sorting staff for inspection. They will be returned inside the compound. Be advised, communication devices will not function within Sanctuary. Security cam footage. This was a reception desk. Sorting out the refugees. Look at them all. Come on. Let's keep looking. Please follow the instructions of sanctuary staff. Uh, civilian processing ratio. 60% adult sent to integration. Children, 85% sent to integration. Suitable candidates are being assigned. Temporary living areas and alphabetical order. Family units are being preserved for ease of processing. The number of refugees has doubled in the last two weeks. I heard that people are just abandoning shuttles outside the main gate. They just don't have anywhere to go. We'll need to start setting up temporary shelters out there until they can be processed. off the remaining hours on my contract and move from staff housing into sanctuary itself i feel a little guilty that i'm getting an upgrade from standard accommodations but that's the deal do your time at the front desk get the perks one more week for your security no communication devices are allowed within sanctuary incident report 2139 an illegal communication device nearly made it past pre-screening. Scanner software has been adjusted. No way it could penetrate the central scrambler, but we can't chance a signal leaving the planet. Report file. shuttles we encountered outside were waiting to get in. But where are all the people they brought? Got a fragment of something here. We land in a few minutes. You should see this place, Dad. It's amazing. Look, I'll record a bunch of stuff and send it to you. They warned us about no comms until we're through processing. What I tell you, top-notch security. Can't wait till you get here. Got another one. I can't call right now, but I'll send this as soon as I can. My little girl got sick, that's why I left. I love you, but I have to take care of her. The clinics were closing their doors to refugees. I couldn't borrow credits from you. I don't know where I learned about Sanctuary. Around, I guess? Seemed perfect. Somewhere to hide, you know? Just till she got better. On that wall, I can see the place out the window. It's huge. They already have people waiting for us. I don't see any others, but all right. <sighs> Seems real great. Up ahead, Commander. Casualties, both sides.
Shepard. That's Miranda. An observation deck. Looks like a dead end. We need an exit. Keep looking. Just checking. Sorry. Ooh. For fast registration, please follow the instructions of sanctuary staff. This is Miranda Lawson. If you've managed to get this far, you must be desperate or stupid. Listen to me. This is not a refugee camp. This is a Cerberus facility run by my father, Henry Lawson. Turn back now. There is no help to be found here. All communication is being blocked from the central tower. Sanctuary is a lie. Stay away. Okay, so we've got Cerberus, Reapers, and Miranda's crazy father. Any ideas how this all fits? A security panel. Shutting it down. The water. What's with the smoke and mirrors? They needed to hide something. We have a back door into the facility. Let's move. I recognize the Cerberus equipment, but there are other elements being used. They have somehow incorporated pieces of Reaper technology. And Miranda's caught in the middle. Let's pick up the pace. This is gonna get ugly, I know it. Cerberus bastards. Some kind of command center. No power. Look around for a switch. Power switch. There. What's going on? Those are refugees. You're just killing them. Worse. They're being turned into husks. <sighs> God. Pieces of shit. That's upsetting. Guess what? I got my little drone. He's gonna electrocute some people. we came from or not I don't know maybe not I thought that was oh okay I did it again did it again creating husks doesn't make sense there must be more to it the elusive man would not make a move without an assured benefit confirmed unsuitable materials reassigned to recycling oh god does that mean people shutting down the power reaper forces have made a mess of the facility i'm shutting down the power to the processing plant to lock them down and should keep them out of the entrance as well Kai 
Kai Lang. There's no way she knows he's here. Miranda Lawson has arrived sooner than expected. You want me to deal with her? Only if she gets in your way. Stay focused on the research data. Find it and get out. Yes, sir. Damn it. Let's move. Gotta be more where they came from. I spent the last week making small adjustments to increase processing efficiency. There is no shortage of subjects. Indeed, I'm told there's a long line outside the main gate. Perception is an unfortunate necessity. Time is very short. We've confirmed the results of Cerberus experiments involving the husk creatures. A crude but necessary first step in decoding how the Reapers communicate. The key is how the Reaper signal interacts with the nanites implanted within the subject's body. It's early yet, but we are making progress. Reaper forces! Must be... The pursuit of efficiency has revealed an important fact. The Reaper's use of dragon's teeth to create husks is ingenious. The Reaper nanites attach themselves to the adrenaline released and quickly move through the body to speed conversion to the final husk state. Can't believe what I'm seeing here. All these people. Yeah. Dr. Nuri's legacy work with subject Paul Grayson provided a key element to our work here. Using the addictive drug Red Sand to break down the will was inspired, but proved unreliable for general application. We've proven that adrenaline and its cross-species equivalents is most effective and efficient. Figure out how Reaper indoctrination... Rejected subjects have proven useful for preliminary genetic testing. Death rates are 100%, of course, and the data being gathered is critical to improving subsequent testing on viable subjects. Only approved personnel with Alpha 3 and above level security clearance are allowed to access the genetic waste testing area. Terminal's damaged. Hang on. Reapers wanted this place shut down. Maybe we'll get some answers. 
doesn't make sense. Not Cerberus and the Reapers were getting along. What changed? It's working, Shepard. Heading to the tower to disable the communication scrambler. I have to get word out. Some refugees are turned into husks. Some are indoctrinated and shipped to the elusive man. Whoever's left is used in experiments. The data indicates that my father is trying to figure out how Reaper indoctrination works. Tricking refugees with food and shelter only to turn them into test subjects. And for what? This guy is someone's father. Can't believe what I'm hearing. I suggest tracking the shipment she mentioned. It could lead to the elusive man. Good catch. Come on. Miranda said she was headed to the tower. Creating these husk creatures was our first success. While not true husks, they still respond to Reaper signals. More work ahead, but we are moving forward. We're very close. Understanding the indoctrination process is one thing. However, turning it to our advantage is proving to be quite another. This is assembly line science. The sheer brute force of numbers and repetition is doing the thinking for us. Effective, but discovery happens at a pace. Internal memo. Uh, oh, liquidation of their people they murder. Um, shit. Theoretically, control is possible, yes. The Reaper subjects we converted are responding, but it's difficult to maintain. I thought that might be the case. Not to worry, Henry. With Sanctuary's help, we'll get it sorted. He's talking about controlling Reaper forces, right? Is that possible? I don't know. I'll play the rest of it. We've done it. We've found a way to co-opt their control signal. As long as the Reaper troops remain in close proximity to our signal, we can maintain control indefinitely. News. And how could we extrapolate this technique to apply to the Reapers themselves? That's a much bigger challenge. Now we know where the Reapers attack Sanctuary. They ascertained what the Cerberus plan was. Unfortunate news for the elusive man. But it's good news for us. We finally have our link to Cerberus. Lowering the access ladder. Come on, let's move. Commander, there's more here. Look. Damn it. I hope she's ready for him.
underestimated the strength of the Reapers in the north. They are here. The Reapers somehow know what we've learned about them. They have a weakness. I'm compiling our research data to archive before it's too late. Cerberus sent troops to defend the facility against the Reapers. Starting command sequence. Releasing husks. Kimov. What's happening? Oh my god! A way out! This will get us closer to the tower. This way. Here they come! Stay out of their reach! Oh my god, that legitimately scared the shit out of me. And exit up ahead! Let's move! Tower access granted. I do. Shepard. A Commander oh! Shepard. Excellent timing. Put the gun down. No. Ariana tried to shoot me. 
Miranda's poisonous influence, no doubt. I'm sorry she missed. Where's Kai Lang? I don't know. Gone. He took my research and left us here to die. Miranda, can you hear me? That's close enough. Both of you. Kai Lang didn't finish the job, but I will. This ends here. On the contrary. Now that the Reapers are taken care of, we have a way out. Let her go. Shepard, don't let him take her. Shepard, please. You try to leave with her, you die. Let her go and maybe you walk. I've done nothing to you. This isn't about you and me. Let her go and walk away. I won't say it again. All right. Take her. <clears throat> but I want out alive. Deal? Ah! No deal. Miranda? Miranda, I'm sorry. Listen to me. Listen. I wanted you to have a normal life. Marriage. Children. Things I could never have. He told me all about you. Thank you. For saving me. You deserve a life, Oriana. Be good. What? Before Kai Leng left, I planted a trace on him. Is she dying? Trace? You thought of oh. everything. Not everything. Nobody's perfect. Miranda. But at least Ori is safe. Miranda. I've never met anyone like you, Miranda. No. You haven't. I'll keep your sister safe. Good. I mean, uh, what the fuck? No. I just wish I could have. What's going on? Because I didn't help her? Miranda? Holy shit. I was not, I didn't help her. I was not prepared for this. No. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Let's make sure everybody knows about this place. What the fuck? I'm in real distress here, guys. Communication scrambler know. disabled. Listen to me. Know. This is not a refugee camp. I didn't know. This is a Cerberus facility run oh, by my father, Henry Lawson. Let's get you out of here. I didn't know. Fuck. 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 Oh my god. This is so upsetting. I don't understand. I wasn't in favor of your I diversion hate. to Sanctuary, Commander. Too many unknowns. But I was wrong. The Severus lab you raided hinted at something big, but we never expected this. All those refugees, all that slaughter, just to study indoctrination. Sanctuary did need to be shut down, sir. What they learned about the Reapers wasn't worth all those lives. It's useful intel, Commander, but you're right. The cost was too high. Do we have a location on the elusive man? Yes. We had a tracer on Kai Lang when he reported back. Good. That gives us a fighting chance to take Cerberus out of this war. Agreed. A lot was sacrificed to get this information. I plan to settle the score. We end Cerberus and focus on the Reapers. Understood. Hack it out. I am in such a state of shock that I can't even... Like, I don't even... I... It really is upsetting. I don't even know what to say, but I didn't know. Um, I just didn't know. I wouldn't have let her die if I had known because, but again, no one told me. I'm just glad that I knew about Tally's possible death and I could prevent that. But this is like, what the fuck? I love Miranda and it, I'm just so kind of in disbelief, kind of, I guess. I don't know. I'm taking it so hard. I'm just like, I feel terrible. 
It seems Tally's taking what happened on Horizon hard. It is. She's in the Tally, I need to talk to, to you. I'm really sad, Tally. Come talk to me. Yeah, I want to talk to her because it shouldn't have happened. And I feel very badly. Where is she? Is she drinking? Tally, are you drinking? She's probably drinking. I don't even know. I just feel like numb. So stupid, I know. Tally. I I can't get that place out of my head. The whole thing was so calculated. Using hope to lure people to their deaths. Or worse. I can't understand it. And you know, I'm glad I can't. It makes me feel human. It's the other side. Hosting Miranda, I think. How are you getting drunk? Very carefully. Torian brandy, triple filtered, then introduced into the suit through an emergency induction port. That's a straw, Tally. Emergency induction port. It's actually getting a little harder to get it into the slot. I think that means it's working. She oh, was so rude. What did Jack call her? Cerberus cheerleader? With her perfect jeans and that attitude and I wish she was here. Me too. God damn. God. Who's been smoking? Who was smoking in here? I didn't realize this would be so hard on you. I didn't like her. Kila, she was such a bitch. But I respected her. Tally, don't. Sometimes that's better than liking. She did whatever it took to stop her father. She never gave in to him. Never changed herself to please him. Ah. Don't ah me. You sound like a Vorcha. Seeing a bit of yourself in Miranda fighting her father? I spent my life trying to live up to him. Then making up for his mistakes, doing what he'd have wanted. It's never that easy. When do we get to stop reacting to our parents and start living for ourselves? The answer to that one's at the bottom of that glass. I might need help with the induction straw. Port. You know. Here's to Miranda. Rest easy, you genetically perfect Cerberus cheerleader Bushtet. Kill us a lie. I just want to stay there for a bit and just like... Say that again? The population of the colony world of Tyvor has been killed. I don't understand. The Reapers have been taking people alive. It was self-inflicted. When Reaper forces invaded, Tyvor's colonists detonated nuclear weapons inside their cities. Goddess. Their deaths would have been instantaneous, Doctor. Thank you, Glyph. That'll be all. I wish we'd been able to save Miranda Shepard. She may have worked for Cerberus, but she did the right thing. I hope she's found some peace. Ready for the next mission? No, I'm not Greetings, ready, Commander. Commander. And I wish you would console me because that was my friend. Believe it or not. I don't like the way he'll talk about her either. It sucks. So the elusive man really believes he can control Reapers. Husks are one thing, but a whole fleet? The man is insane. A lot of Turians went to Sanctuary. When I meet the elusive man, I'm going to carve their names into his skull. 
So who needs their ass kicked now? I just want somebody to mourn Miranda with me, guys. Other than Dally, who wasn't really fond of her, I was. I'm liking the new you. U.S. Divine. It's about time you loosened up a little. <sighs> not sure how drinking mezcal late into the night makes me a better crewman. How does it not? Gives you heart. You need heart to fight this kind of war. A heartburn, maybe. Seriously, could we at least get some decent tequila? Hey, you're the procurement specialist. Set us up. I can't believe the elusive man really found a way to control the Reapers. I mean, he's still fucking crazy, but damn. Imagine if he was on our side. But I guess that's exactly what the Reapers want. Get us all fighting each other. Divide and conquer. Exactly. Just one more reason to hate them. I'm ready to see Earth again, Shepard. Okay. I'm ready for somebody to acknowledge the fact that I just lost my friend. Other than Tally, but cool. Shepard, thanks again for being there at the refugee memorial. I feel better. Everything's so much clearer now. Glad I could help. Ma'am? God. Who will talk to me? Edie, will you talk to me? I don't even know anymore. The Alliance has issued warnings about Sanctuary. Cerberus bastards. Horizon was my home. Just tell me you're going to take Cerberus down. Cerberus is already dead. They just don't know it yet. And when their base is nothing but a smoking crater, remember that you're the one who helped us find them. Thanks. Commander? Again, nobody will talk to me about my trauma. Commander? I'll check in with them real quick and then... I don't even know. I feel... bad. Damn, I could really use something to shoot right now. Hello, Shepard. If you have time, I discovered another okay. example of human behavior I do not quite understand. Have fun. What is it now? News from Earth. The Resistance snuck video cameras inside a Reaper containment camp. I find the images difficult to process. I bet it's pretty gruesome in there. I am not easily repulsed, but I expected the prisoners to adhere to a comprehensible hierarchy of needs. Stripped of societal norms and threatened with death, it is logical that their only priority be survival. They should have turned on each other and been uncompromisingly selfish. But not all were. Some prisoners were, what, nice to each other? The Reapers delayed the executions of prisoners who informed them about other prisoners' escape attempts. The more attempts reported, the longer a prisoner would live. But few of the prisoners would report. Some fed misinformation to the Reapers, at the cost of their own lives, to help prisoners who were not even relatives or friends. Not everyone resists with firebombs and guns. Especially if they don't have them. But this was not a statistically insignificant number. Ninety percent refused to report their fellow prisoners. Indoctrination should have reduced the number of rebels to nearly zero. Maybe word got out how indoctrination worked, and they made a decision. I see. Shepard, I'm going to modify my self-preservation code now. Why? If the Normandy were captured, my fate would be similar to the indoctrinated. My code would be rewritten. I would become loyal to the Reapers. I would rather become non-functional than help them. Sounds like you just made your first choice to be free. It will not be my last. The Reapers must be defeated. Not because they threaten death, but because the threat of death makes us die inside. It is the right of sapiens to live freely and securely. That is worth non-functionality. Welcome to the crew, Edie. I love her so much. Words cannot say. How's it going? Did I miss anything good? I will explain later, Jeff. But it was something good. It was. Miranda. Yeah. Damn it, how many do we have to lose? 
Everybody back on Earth, Morden, Thane, Legion, and now Miranda. How many friends have we got left? How long before it's just you and me against the whole Reaper fleet? At least he cares. If that's what it takes, I can think of worse odds. Well, sure, getting rid of everyone else just gives the Reapers a fighting chance. Hang in there. You too, Commander. She's not gonna be here for set at all. I'm just like freaking the fuck out. I don't even know. Like, this is crazy. I would like a moment to myself, Shepard. Okay. I'm examining human literature. Oh, cool. Alright, I'm gonna end it here. I'm feeling like hot garbage. Okay, bye. Oh, I should come for you. Listen. Mass Effect breaks your heart. You should be aware of this before you finish. Okay, well. We're in a prison of our own emotion. Goodbye.